why should more SMBs prioritize cybersecurity? Attackers actually don't care how big or small your company is. And SMBs are usually smaller organizations that don't have a very large IT security budget, so they are vulnerable. Microsoft recently published a digital defense report. And in this report, we are seeing 35% more cyber attacks in the first half of this year than the second half of last year. So the risks are really quite high. So what we're seeing today, essentially, is the fact that cyber criminals are profiting of innocent organizations. And SMEs are focusing a lot of investment towards sustaining their business, towards growing their business today during COVID. And that's leading them to be a soft target for the cyber criminals, especially when it comes to ransomware. Cybersecurity is even more important now because when COVID-19 hit, a lot of organizations had to send their employees home to work very, very quickly. So some of them were actually not prepared. Traditionally, a lot of organizations have security that is based on their corporate network. So if you're in a corporate network, you're pretty much protected. But with employees working from home, they're using their home Wi-Fi or they're working outside of office in public Wi-Fi and they are also using more devices. Some of them are their personal devices. So the level of protection in those are less. So we actually need to look at how to protect the company's data and their employees in these new times. So here are some tips for SMEs to protect themselves against cyber attacks. Number one, use multi-factor authentication. All communication platforms provide the ability to use a password as well as an additional form of security. Number two, please encrypt all content, especially when you're sending it over an email. Word, PowerPoint, Excel, all can be easily protected with a password. And yes, please send the password separately. Number three, check authenticity of email and web links you click on. There is a lot of information available on our YouTube channels to identify phishing attempts. Number four, turn on Windows Defender if you're using a Windows 10 machine. And yes, update your machines. We are scanning the internet on your behalf and providing you the protection through security updates. So please apply them. And number five, be aware of the scams in your region. Every government today has a platform where they share this detail. We're in this together. Stay safe.